فاسألوا أهل الذكر إن كنتم لا تعلمون الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على من أرسله الله رحمة للعالمين سيدنا ونبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه ومن تبعهم بإحسان إلى يوم الدين أما بعد The question that was asked is الجرح والتعديل um, is it ijtihad is jarh wa ta'dil based upon ijtihad is ijtihad is striving ijtihad is striving is jarh wa ta'dil based upon striving uh, brothers we have to understand that the aqwal of the ulama is jarh wa ta'dil jarh wa ta'dil means criticism uh, it means criticism and praising um, the, pra- the praising and the criticism of the scholars um, regarding one another is purely ijtihad. Um, when we say ijtihad, that would mean it can be right and it can be wrong. If a scholar criticizes another scholar or um, he praises another scholar, he can be right and he can be wrong in his criticism and then also in his praising. It's a matter which يَقْبَلُ الْإِصَابَةَ وَالْخَطَى It can carry correct or wrong. That's what I'm saying. Ijtihad is this. But the person who's doing the ijtihad, which is a great scholar, who has reached that level, he is allowed to do it. If he gets it wrong, مَأْجُورٌ He is rewarded على ijtihadi for his striving. Um, and he has one reward for it. But if he gets it right, he has two. But if he doesn't get it right and he gets it wrong, he gets one reward, and he's not sinning. Because the messenger says, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, إِذَا حَكَمَ الْحَاكِمُ If the person who's judging judges, فَاجْتَهَدْ And he strives. ثُمَّ أَصَابَ And then he gets it right. فَلَهُ أَجَوَانِ He gets two reward. وَإِنْ حَكَمَ But if he rules, فَاجْتَهَدْ And he strived. ثُمَّ أَخْطَى But he gets it wrong. فَلَهُ أَجْرُونَ He has one reward. So he is between, between what is he between? He is either between one reward or two rewards. So he's no sinning on him. Okay, um, but there's a matter we need to keep in mind, which is the original essence of the people of knowledge, Ahlul Ilm, who have reached that status of knowledge. Uh, the asal of a person of knowledge is adlib wa insaf, that he is a just individual, and that he's a person who would follow the text. Um, nothing would take him out of following the the religion correctly and no whims and desires or uh, is in himself okay a scholar that's what we believe in, of him originally but that doesn't mean uh, that the scholar sometimes something may carry him but that thing that carries a scholar in order to criticize another scholar there has to be evidences that indicate that show it because as I said the original essence of the scholar is that he is a person who is just a person who is um, fair. But if we see and we sense that this matter is not based upon true point evidence, but it's what? Lihawan. There's a whim, there's desire in it. Imam huh? Dhabi, rahimahullah, he said it. He said, rahimahullah ta'ala, and this is in his kitab, Sir Ala bin Ubala. Dhabi, rahimahullah, he said, Lasna nadda'i fi aymati al-jarh wa ta'adil al-asmata min al-ghalat al-nadiri. You pay attention. He said, we won't claim that the scholars of Jarh wa Ta'deel, that they have in them al-usma, that they are infallible, min al-ghalati, from mistakes, al-nadiri, which are rare. We won't say that. وَلَا مِنَ الْكَلَامِ بِنَفْسٍ حَادٍ فِي مَنْ بَيْنَهُ وَبَيْنَهُمْ شَحْنَا وَإِحْنَا And we won't also claim, for the people of Jarh wa Ta'deel, that they're infallible from what? Uh, speech, which is based upon harshness, and it's due to shahna. They have something towards one another. And he said, we realize, وَقَدْ عُلِمَ أَنَّ كَثِيرًا مِنْ كَلَامِ الْأَقْرَانِ And a lot of the times, it has been known, uh, and documented, that a lot of contemporaries, مُهْدَرٌ لَا عِبْرَةَ بِهِ He tried to put the other one down, where there's nothing really behind it. I mean, there's no pure evidence that he supplied regarding that person. Um, he also said, Rahimahullah, he said, وَكَلَامُ الْأَقْرَانِ بَعْضِهِمْ فِي بَعْضٍ لَا يُعْبَعُ بِهِ 
scholars who are contemporaries regarding one another is not looked into, is not given consideration. Regard, especially especially if it becomes apparent that it's due to enmity. Only madhab, or because it's due to each one ascribes to a different madhab. Only hasad, or there's an indication to show you that there's hasad involved. Okay? وَمَا يَنْجُوا مِنْهُ The Habi said, not many people are saved from it. إِلَّا مَنْ عَصَمَهُ اللَّهِ Except the person who Allah saves him from it. وَقَدْ عَلِمْتُ وَمَا عَلِمْتُ The Habi said, I, have, I do not know أَنَّ عَصْرًا مِنَ الْأَعْصَارِ That there was ever an, an, a, a, a time from the generation that came. سَلِمَ uh, أَهْلُهُ That the people were saved. مِنْ ذَلِكَ That they were saved from this type of uh, uh, this enmity or this grouping and this madhab or hasad towards one another. He said, I don't know an era where we can say this was safe, there's no, that the people didn't, the scholars didn't have this in their hearts. I don't know a time that ever come, came by. Except, he said, except prophets, siddiqeen, the truthful ones. Walau shi'tu, he said, if he wanted, Dhabi said, lasaradtu min dhalika karasis. Lasaradtu min dhalika kararis. If he wanted, I can write books after that, scrolls. Regarding to proof, how many people did this? Ibn Abdul Barr, rahimahullah, he said, إِلَّا مَنْ صَحَّتْ عَدَالَتُهُ Anyone who becomes clear to us his adl, his reliability, his justness, becomes clear to us, وَثَبَتَتْ And it becomes also clear to us, فِي الْعِلْمِ أَمَانَتُهُ his, his truthfulness, huh? in terms of knowledge, وَبَانَتْ ثِقَتُهُ And in the fact that he's a thiqa, it becomes clear to us in knowledge, لَمْ يُلْتَفَتْ We will not look at it. And it should not be looked into. إِلَىٰ قَوْلِ أَحَدٍ The speech of a person. إِلَّا أَنْ يَأْتِيَ Unless he comes with. فِي جَرْحِ In the criticism of this person. بِبَيِّلَةٍ Clear evidence. عَادِلَةٍ Which is just. يَصِحُّ That can be uh, that be, can be correct. بِمَا جَرَحَهُ In which he criticized him for. عَلَىٰ طَرِيقِ الشَّهَادَاتِ In a way of witnessing. وَالْعَمَلِ فِيهَا مِنَ الْمُشَهَادَاتِ الْمُعَيَنَةِ It has to be a matter which eyes can see. Observation can't be matters like behind closed doors and it has to be clear cut. Ah. And a lot of the times we hear youngsters who really don't have a lot of understanding, who keep repeating the word al muqaddamun al-ta'adeen. That criticism takes precedence over praise. And they keep repeating this and they think with due to their ignorance that this is at its generalization. That this is just open like that. But this is jahal and adam al and it only comes from ignorance and not observing and studying. Rather, there's another ruling and another principle which stands and each and every one of them have, t it, scholars have, rahimahumullah uh, jami'an, they apply them both correctly. So not, you can't do itlaq of any of the two. The other one which is kalam al-aqrani fi ba'din yutwa wa la yurwa. That the contemporaries, that which they have said a bit about one another is, is not taken into consideration. Ah. Uh, and it's not narrated. Okay? Scholars have said that also as well. So this point that we have to understand is if the person doesn't come with, and this is a tafsil which is important to, look to look, be looked into. That is, if the person who's criticizing this individual does not bring bayina, adilatun, clear cut evidences, which can be taken and considered, and it's based on fairness and justness, and this evidence is clear, huh? then we take it. If not, Baqiyat Adalat, this person remains reliable. We take his speech. We won't look into yours. And Imam at Taj al Sukhi, rahimahullah, he said, Al Hadaru Kul al Hadar. Warning the people. Uh, everyone warned from this. Which is what? An Tafhama Qa'idatum. That you understand the principle of the scholars. Al Jarah Muqaddam Al Ta'adil. Sukhi saying this. In its own, Ala Itlaqiha, just like that, in the open. Without giving it any tafsil and explanations. You just take it like that. But it's sawabi, but the correct is, Sukhi say this. Anyone whose reliability becomes firm. His imam, his imam, and the fact that he's an imam becomes affirmed. And the people who praise him are a lot. And the ones who criticize him are very rare. Huh? وَكَانَتْ هُنَاكَ And there's also an indication قَرِينَةٌ دَالَةٌ عَلَى سَبَبِ جَرْحِ مِنْ تَعَصُّبِ مَذْهَبِي أو غيره لم يلتفت إلى جرحي And there's another clear evidence that also indicates that this is based, this criticism is based upon مذهب or is based upon what? 
other means, other reasons, then the criticism is not given any 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 look. Ah, it's not given every any look. It's not given any look. He also said, Arahimahullah, huh? Arafna and al Jari Halayuk Balamin Hujah. Araf Arafnaka come to make we've we've brought to your attention and we made you understand that the criticism is not accepted or the criticizer who's criticizing his criticism is not accepted. Wa in even if he comes with jarh with his khasar, is not accepted. Ah. Fi haqi man ghalabat. Ah. عرفناك أن الجارح لا يقبل منه الجرح وإن فسره even if he gives a detailed criticism is not looked at and it's not accepted في حق إن إن towards the right of who من غلب قاعته على معصيته the person whose obedience has overcome his disobedience وما يحوه and the people who have praised him are more على the على the me the ones who are criticizing him ومراز و و ها وَمُزَكُّوهُ عَلَى جَارِحِينَ And the praises, the ones who praise them, are more than the ones who criticize them. إِذَا كَانَتْ هُنَاكَ مُنَافَسَةٌ دُنْيَوِيَةٌ If there is what? There is, the, there is that challenge, worldly challenge between the two. كَمَا يَكُونُ بَيْنَ النُّظَرَاء Like it happens between the contemporaries. أَوْ غَيْنِ ذَلِكَ أَوْ أَذَّنِتْ وَحِينَ إِذِ الْفَلَا يُرْتَفَتْ At that time, we don't look into it. Such as what? لِكَلَامِ الثَّوْرِيُّ That which Imam Sufyan al-Thawri said and other than him which he said about Abu Hanifa we don't give it a look. What Abi Dhibbin and what Abi Dhibbin said about Imam Malik we don't look at it. And what Yahya ibn Al-Hain said about Imam Shafi'i we don't look at it. And that which Imam Al-Nasai said about Ahmed ibn Salih we also don't look at it. Ah. All of those are examples he brought. Sukhi. وَلَوْ أَطْلَقْنَا تَقْدِيمَ الْجَرْحَ If we if we generalize and we just open it على مصرعيها just like that that the jarh takes precedence over the ta'deel. Huh? لَمَا سَلِمَ لَنَا أَحَدٍ Nobody will be safe for us. مِنَ الْأَئِمَّةِ From the scholars. From the a'imma. Nobody will be safe for us. إِذْ مَا مِنْ إِمَامٍ Because there is not an imam إِلَّا وَقَدْ طَعَنَ فِي طَاعِنُونَ Except that somebody criticized him. وَهَلَكَ فِيهِ الْهَالِكُونَ So brothers, what we have to understand in this issue is what? إِذَا قَامَتِ الْبَيِّنَةِ If clear-cut evidence comes to us, العادلة which is just على خطأه this person's mistake أو عرض كلامه or that person's speech is taken and it's presented in front of the book of Allah and the Sunnah and his speech goes that person who's been criticized his speech goes against the Kitab and it goes against the Sunnah فإن قوله مردود then the person who the speech is criticized ولا يلزم sorry if a person he it becomes clear pay attention sorry إذا قامت البينة if clear-cut evidence brings to us and shows us that is just the mistake or his speech is presented to the kitab and the sunnah and they go against it that person's speech is rejected and it's not necessary according to the principle of the people of knowledge and that that person is being that, 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 that this person is made a muqtada or that we take him out of Ahlul Sunnah. Just because of that mistake we found in him, we reject the mistake. But that mistake, automatically, we don't say he's an innovator. Or we don't place a ruling on him which we say you've left Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah. Regarding matters which are what? Masail al ilmiyati wal amaliyah. Bimujarra di khatahi. Just because he done a mistake in what? Masail al ilmiyah and masail al فَإِنْ أَصَرَّ عَلَى خَطَاهِ If the person is persistent upon his mistake, أو بارد معصيته, أو his shortcoming has become very clear. فالجرح المفسر, the detailed criticism, now at this point, مقدم is given precedence على التعديل on the criticism, on the praise that was present. On the praise that was present. Because he is persistent upon the mistake, he chose not to come back from it. As for if the person is ignorant about the matter. Um, in jahila muradu. As for if the person is ignorant about the intent. فَيُنظَرُ فِي سِيرَةِ الْمُجْتَهِدِ We look at the seerah of this individual, this mujtahid. إِنْ كَانَتْ حَسَنَةً If it was a good life he lived. حُمِلَ كَلَامُهُ The speech of his that we have. What do we do? We take it. We push it. 
to a good interpretation, good meaning. Because Allah said in the Quran, وَالْبَلَدُ الطَّيِّبُ The land which is good, يَخْرُجُ نَبَاتُ بِإِذْنِ رَبِّهِ The land which is good, it brings out crops, good crops. The land is good, the crops are good, with the permission of Allah. وَإِنْ كَانَتْ سِيرَةُ غَيْرَ ذَلِكَ But if his biography shows us that he was an evil person, this speech of his that we have, we will take it to the evilest of meanings, because Allah said, وَالَّذِي خَبُثَ لَا يَخْرُجُ إِلَّا نَكِدًا that which, the land which is corrupted does not bring except corruption. So the person is a Mu'tazili uh, Mu and Masailul Iman, we find mistakes, we will take it according to his madhab. He's an Ash'ari and he's talking about Masailul Asma'i, Masailul Asma'i wa Sifat, and we say his kalam which is Muhim, we'll take it to the meaning of according to his madhab. We won't say, oh, maybe he means it according to Aqeedat Ali Sunnati, wal Jama'ah. And والعلم عند الله تعالى وآخر دعوانا للحمد لله رب العالمين